हेलो एवरीवन आई एम मोहित जैन एंड वेलकम टू टीसीएस एनक्यूटी एक्चुअल क्वेश्चन आर्क्स ऑन 28 अक्टूबर 2020 इन द सेकंड स्लॉट राजू लेंड्स रुपीस 3000 टू बी एंड अ सर्टेन सम टू सी एट द सेम टाइम एट 6% पर एनम सिंपल इंटरेस्ट इफ आफ्टर 5 इयर्स राजू टुगेदर रिसीव्स 1650 एज इंटरेस्ट फ्रॉम बी एंड सी व्हाट इज द सम लेंड टू सी so now we know the formula for to find simple interest that is p r t by 100 so 1650 would be interest received at the rate 6% in 5 years on what amount isn't it 520 6 24575 and 5 p is Five five zero zero. So amount lent to C is five five zero zero minus three thousand. That is two five zero zero. Find the variance of the following data. We know that formula for variance is summation x minus x bar whole square by n. We need x bar. That is summation of x by n. Summation of x means total of these all. And the total is one sixty eight by one two three four divided by eight. That is twenty one. Now twelve minus twenty one is nine. Nine is square is eighty one. Three hundred and fourteen. So variance is three hundred and fourteen divided by eight. That will give us three. Okay, only option with three is three nine two five. It is thirty nine point two five. S completes a journey in fifteen hours. She travel first and third quarter of the total distance with a speed of 24 kph and second and fourth quarter of the total distance with a speed of 16 kph let uh, the size or the distance of each quarter is uh, x then average speed is total distance 4x by x by 24 plus x by 16 plus x by 24 Plus x by 16. That would be the average speed. So LCM of 24 and 16 is 48. 4 into 48 x upon x common. 48 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 3. That is 10. So average speed is 4 into 48 by 10. So the distance covered. Distance is given by speed. Speed into time two five three. This is forty eight into six two forty and two eighty eight kilometers. If an alloy contains only two metals A and B in the ratio of three is to nine point five, it doesn't look like a ratio. Let multiply it by two, so it would be six is to nineteen. determine the percentage quantity of a in the alloy so this is a part 6 by 19 plus 6 is 25 in 200 that is 24% is a in the alloy s deposited an amount in a bank at a certain rate which is compounded annually when he inquired from the bank after 2 years its value was 1 And after three years, its value was one eighty two five zero five. You know the P into one plus I to the power three upon P into one plus I to the power two. These would be the amount after three years and two years would be one eight two five zero five by one five eight seven zero zero. This calculator value would be one point one five. Cancel out. We get one plus I is one point one five. That means interest rate is fifteen percent. Find the amount deposited by him and the rate of interest. Rate of interest is fifteen percent, and it only fits in with option A. Let's check whether the principal is one lakh twenty thousand or not. So amount is one five eight seven zero zero equals P into now R is fifteen percent one point one five whole square. P is one five eight seven zero zero by one point one five whole square. On dividing, we'll get 
वन लैख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड सो ऑप्शन ए फिट्स इन ए कैन डू अ पीस ऑफ वर्क इन ट्वेंटी डेज ए एंड सी टुगेदर कैन डू इन फिफ्टीन डेज ए बी सी कैन डू इट इन टेन डेज then in how many days b and c together can do so if we see from a b c if i deduct this a i'll get b and c isn't it so i just need to use the deduction formula deduction formula is product by difference so this would be 20 into 10 by 20 minus 10 200 by 10 is 20 days b and c would be completing the job in 20 days if they are working together A mobile dealer sells a mobile at a discount of 25% on its marked price and earns a profit of 10%. If the marked price is 8800, marked price is given directly give discount on the marked price that is 142200. So his income or the received price is 6600 which is giving him 10% profit on CP. That means CP is 6600. Into ten by eleven, that is six thousand rupees. The mean of sixteen observation is twenty nine. This is mean, and on adding four more observation, the new means become thirty two. That means for thirty observation, mean is thirty two. What is the mean of the last four observation? Now twenty six into twenty nine is seven fifty four. And thirty into thirty-two is nine sixty. So the difference should be the total of these four new elements. That's two zero six. So the mean of the last four observation is two zero six by four. That is fifty one point five zero. The length of a rectangular sheet is twice its breadth. Breadth is x, length is 2x. Area of the sheet is 242. That means 2x square is 242. x square is 121. x equals to 11. So what is the length? We have taken twice its breadth. Breadth is 11. Length is 2 into 11. That is 22 centimeter. The number of students in three classes are in the ratio one is to three is to five. Sixteen students are increased in each class. Now we have x plus sixteen, three x plus sixteen, and five x plus sixteen. Now the new ratio is three is to five is to seven. So this is three is to five is to seven. We can take any two and solve for x. 5x plus 80 equals 9x plus 48. 4x is 32. x equals to 8. The total number of students in three classes after increase is 5 plus 3 8 and 1 9. 9x that is 9 into 8 is 72 and 16 into 3 is 48. So it is 120. Five years ago, Rahul's age was five years less than three times the sum of the ages of his three children. Three times sum of the ages of three children. Five years less. Okay. After five years hence, that means from this particular point, we need to add ten years. So Rahul would be R plus ten. His age will become five years more than sum of ages of the three children. So sum of ages of three children would be s plus thirty, and his age would be five. So r is three s minus five. So we have three s minus five plus ten equals s plus thirty five. Okay, three s minus s is. 2s plus 5, that is 30. S, that is sum of 
three children's age is it 15 so r was 15 into 3 that is 45 minus 5 that is 40 years 5 years ago so present age of r is 40 plus 5 that is 45 years The run scored by Ramesh in 10 matches are given. What is the mean score? We know the mean is just summation x by n and median. For median, we need to arrange it. Let arrange it. We have 29. So, the total of all is 606. So, mean is 606 by 10. That is 60.6. .6. Now, the median median is 10 plus 1 by 2 that is 5.5th element that is 5th element 63 plus 6th element 67 by 2 that is 65 so 65 is the median and mean is 60.6 .6. option c fits in two trains L1 and L2 in length are running in the same direction, same direction on parallel tracks. The first train runs at 25 meter per second, second at 20 meter per second. How long will they take to cross each other? Th since they are moving in same direction, time taken to cross each other would be L1 plus L2 upon difference in the speed because both are moving in the same direction. So that would be 200 plus 180 meters by 25 minus 20 meter per second that is 380 by 5 second that is 76 second 76 second means 1 minute and 76 minus 60 will give 16 seconds 1 minute 16 second option C what is the greatest four digit number which is divisible by 5 10 15 and 20 lcm of 5 10 15 and 20 is 60 that means we are looking out for multiple of 60 and which is the greatest four digit number the greatest four digit number is 9999 let's divide quickly this by 60 6399 Again, 399, 360, we'll get 39 as remainder. So, 9999 minus 39 is 9960 is the greatest four digit number which is divisible by 60 or which is divisible by 5, 10, 15, and 20. 9960, option C. The cost price of 30 boxes is same as selling price of x boxes let it be rupees one now we know the debt rule famous rule number four of our rule book debt rule of p q r s profit is given by p s minus r q by r q so here profit will be 30 into one minus x into one by x is 20% 20% means 20 by 100 that is 1 by 5 150 minus 5x is x 6x is 150 x equals 150 by 6 3 2 3 50 that is 25 so what is the value of x x is 25 due to an increase of 10% in the price Four units less are available for rupees 40. We can use the algebraic method, but why to use? When we can use our rule one, line changing rule, and find the answer in no time. Price increases by 10%, that is 1 by 10. That means consumption will decrease by 1 by 10 plus 1, that is 1 by 11. Now 1 by 11 is equivalent to 4 units that means 1 is equivalent to 44 units initially 44 units were purchased now 44 minus 4 
that is only 40 units are purchased for rupees 40 that means now the price per unit is rupee 1 the question asked is what is the present rate of bananas per dirjan dirjan means 12 units so the price of 12 units now is rupee 1 into 12 that is rupees 12 to complete a work, P takes 25% more time than Q. So if I assume that Q takes 4x days, then 25% of 4x is x, P takes 5x days. If together they take 25 days, then the formula for together is product by sum, product is 20x square and sum is 9x is 25 that means x equals 45 by 4 how much time does q takes to do it alone q takes 4x days 4 into 45 by 4 that is 45 days option a Thank you everyone for participating. These were few questions from TCS NQT 20th October 2020 second slot examination of numerical ability. For questions or comments, please do telegram us or email us. The telegram number and email ID is there on the screen. I'm Mohit Jain signing off from MJ's Maths and Stats. Please subscribe to the channel. I'll see you soon. Thank you.